When using the fill in gaps feature, you must just be careful, it only works when there are nulls. So in this report, for example, instead of having blanks, someone's actually filled this all in with zeros, or the system has filled it in. So let's try and go into Power Query. So we've got it, perfect, we know exactly what we mean. I'm gonna click there, go Transform, I'm gonna say Fill it down, and you'll see it does nothing. And that's because it can only fill in blanks, and these are clearly not blanks, they're zeros. So we need to somehow get these zeros to become blanks. So you might have to just do one step first. I'm going to highlight that cell there. Under transform, there's an item called replace values. So what I'm going to say is please take anywhere that you find a zero. And in Power Query to say replace it with nothing, I can actually type the word null. So when I say OK, you'll see all my zeros are replaced with nulls. I'm just going to do the same thing here. place with null and now what I can do is I can highlight these and go and fill the items so there's just one extra step to enable you to make use of this full function